Against all odds, we are back for the finale. <laughs> the powers that be really did not want us to finish this game. We, we should not have taunted the Kingdom Hearts curse. It is, it is back with a fury. <laughs> We're here, and this game is going to be finished, and whatever the powers that be do to us afterwards is yet to be seen. <laughs> Nomine, is that you? Well, goodbye. <laughs> Running off to do some more drawings. I've got a message for you. I meant to tell you. I've been watching a friend play uh, Kingdom Hearts 2 recently, and man, her drawings oh. are bad, huh? <laughs> oh. Wow, Namine went golf. I don't know how I feel about this Namine redesign. <laughs> I don't know if that's better or worse than what you said the last time we tried to record this. <laughs> I don't even remember what that was. <laughs> it's just more stereotypical who's that bullshit. Fuck you. Uh -oh. And we both told you to fuck <laughs> off, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we can do it in unison now. Yeah. <laughs> and like last time, we now have the, uh, the, the gear rights minigame. Hell yeah. Well, I mean, one of, one of your AI companions in this is named after my girlfriend, so the whole game is gay rights as far as I'm concerned. I mean, it's also claimed as Sora and Riku, so... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zora and Rico give the vibe that they've been married for years without realizing they're a couple. <laughs> <laughs> they shared the power fruit. They got married as like a tax scam and then it just kinda stuck. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I don't think Sora and Rico have the intent intellect to do a tax scam. I think they do it by accident. Yeah, they just <laughs> they get like shitty drunk one night and they wake up next to each other with like the remains of a consumed palpo fruit. Yeah. And then they just it's it. You gotta fill out the paperwork. Yep. Holy <laughs> yeah. goalie binding apples. <laughs> I mean, that's what happens in Christianity. <laughs> God, I'm just thinking about that, like, dumb, isn't there someone you forgot to ask? <laughs> but, like... It's Sora, Riku, and instead of Jesus, it's Xehanort. <laughs> I was about to say Mickey Mouse. <laughs> that also works. God. <laughs> if Mickey Mouse is the Jesus of this universe, then who's God? Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. <laughs> I feel like Oswald would be Judas. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the, that's true. The forgotten character was going to get a comeback. Unfortunately, the comeback game was Epic Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> Brought to you by Deus Ex's War Inspector. <laughs> oh, oh, that, that explains really so game. fucking much. Yeah. I always forget that that was War Inspector. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. The main thing I remember about Epic Mickey, because I never actually played it, mm -hmm. is like the concept art mm. that got put out before yeah. it came out, where everything was like this dark apocalyptic nightmare with like all the characters being these crazy weird animatronics mm -hmm. that like actively scared the shit out of me because it was like 2007 and I was 12. <laughs> I remember seeing that shit in like a magazine or whatever and I was like, damn, they're actually gonna make Mickey epic, huh? <laughs> And then the game came out, and it was uh, cartoony. Yeah. It was a platformer. I mean, th they knew they were never going to get those designs past Disney. Well, absolutely not, yeah. No, it, then what was the point of releasing them to magazines? Yeah. I hate it. <laughs> but speaking of what Epic, the Epic Mini, Epic Mickey concepts are, um, it just reminds me, that's basically, Bendy and the Ink Machine just totally jacked that <laughs> style completely, did not it? Oh, it really is, holy shit. It's like, it's literally like corrupting ink and shit as well. 
I still, to this day, have not seen anything from Bendy and the Ink Machine. Well, or, okay, I think I've seen, like, the main character design, and that's it. Yeah. It's, like, that thing where I keep hearing about it in the context of, like, this is as popular as Five Nights as F at Freddy's was, yeah. but every time I hear that, it's just like, how is that true? Because I haven't seen shit. Like, what system I, is I have seen for? Bendy toys uh, in yes. toy shops in the UK. As far as I can tell, it's it's another one of those games like Five Nights at Freddy's or Baldi's Basics where it's like it got yeah. really popular among like horror YouTubers and then you actually play the game and it's kind of mediocre. Ah, Amnesia of the Dark Descent. Yeah, it looks very mediocre, but like I think it's the fact that unfortunately, folks, um, we are all too old to get it. It's, it's <laughs> like a kid thing. My, my young nephew absolutely loves Bendy and the ink machine. I don't get it. I'm 24, I'm out of my Markiplier phase. <laughs> I think I'm the oldest one here, I'm fucking ancient compared to you all. I'm like 27. <laughs> wow, you're two years older than me. Yeah. You're as old as one of my girlfriends. Yeah. Yeah. Oh boy, probably, there's a problematic age gap in this LP, <laughs> what <the> fuck. <laughs> I'm also considerably taller than her, so it's just all fucked up. Yeah, just problematic on both sides. Tail as old as time, Yagi as old as rhyme. <laughs> D dare I say, I may have the most abusive relationship. Dun dun dun. <laughs> see, see that, that, that's the problem. If it was like, um, like a hetero one, or like a male male yaoi kind of thing going on, then that'd be okay with the archive of our own audience. Two <laughs> girlfriends? Nah, 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 that's abusive. Yeah, especially the trans girlfriends. Oh, right out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, <back off. laughs> anyway, Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts. Uh, yeah, I just have nothing to contribute to this conversation. Yeah, well, we're, just, we're we're working on getting through the game part of this video. We got we got we got a little bit of that left. Yeah, uh, unfortunately, 3D has never been the most interesting gameplay-wise to talk about because their moveset hasn't really changed. No, you use you you smack things until balloon recharges, and you kill everything with that. Come on, wait up! <laughs> Who are you? I fucking knew it. You're. It's Roha. Roxas. How can you be here? Am I dreaming? The game is called Dream Drop Distance! Come on, <laughs> say something. This could have been the other way around. Huh? But it really has to be you. What do you mean? There are so many hearts that are connected to yours. Don't fucking tell me. You're me. So you can feel what I felt. No. Roxas, you're you. We're not the same. <laughs> the only me is me. And you deserve as much as I do to be your own person. Silent hearts, never to be released. That's why it has to be you. That's the saddest six word story. I don't know, there's another sad one, which is Blue Batine gets a, King a Silent Hill license. <laughs> Your guy is a sad nobody. I have defeated a thousand nobodies. We are not the same. <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird face. Alphonse <laughs> 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 Ross is just like dead eyed staring him down. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Sora is Yagi and me, and Roxas is Austin feeding us the Kingdom Hearts LP. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Sora. Half of you is now transgender. <laughs> Did they cause all this pain? What do you want me to see? I'm pretty certain that was also true because of mysterious unnamed character from 358. And also Domine, I guess. I like the... Um... Riku's lines sound like he's um, speaking from a bathtub. <laughs> like, it's a good touch, like, 
like to have it like say, oh yeah, he's in a dream, and he's like kind of half hearing this as he sleeps. But it does sound like Riku's lying face down in a bathtub and yelling at him from another room. <laughs> you just very faintly hear Caramel dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Who was playing it? Is it Riku or... I think Goofy would. <laughs> I do like this, the entire city, like, fracturing and, um, like, moving. Yeah. Yeah, I really like the whole idea that the world that never was has <clears throat> kind of fallen apart uh, yeah. since two. Um, <laughs> it is just kind of a neat thing to see, sort of like modern sort of art deco city with the King of Hearts characters running around. I'm still a big sucker for that. <laughs> Those really are just some like New York ass buildings, mm. huh? <laughs> yeah, New York, the windy city. <laughs> I feel like we're just recycling bits at this point. Yeah, I, I was recycling the bit, but Austin, I, I want to say I knew I was recycling it, but I was trying to make you angry again. Uh. The, the one time I, I spent a weekend in Chicago, I definitely did walk around going, Oh, it's the Big Apple. <laughs> <laughs> but made sure I didn't do it around that many people, so I just didn't, I didn't instantly get the shit beaten out of me. <laughs> oh god, I cannot remember. Um, I was actually going to go to like Canada and America, but then uh, the plague happened. Yeah. I could have actually met um, uh, your girlfriend, Val. Because I would have been in LA and she's sort of close by in California. Yeah. Other than when she's like, you know, having to move back and forth to the, uh, what I've learned is the Hell Swamp Island, Florida. <laughs> Florida is also one of the few places in the US I've been, but I don't remember it. <laughs> When I it's went totally there, I, I went to Disneyland, so I think the, the, the fucking rock, Kingdom Hearts rock, was already set in then somehow. Yeah, actually, the only time I've been to Florida was to go to Disney World, and it was one of the worst weeks of my life, because I was incredibly sick. <laughs> oh, no. I think the only time I've been outside of Canada was I went to Florida to go to Disney World when no. I was, like, three. <laughs> the only thing I remember, like, from Florida is because I was much younger and I went to see it is, uh, I was watching in the hotel, I was watching like a uh, dark when you duck, and I was like, in my baby mind, I was like, wow, this is great, and then it just wasn't on in the UK, and it was fucking horrible after I went home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, back off! Ah. Yeah, back off! And then I don't think that's on Disney Plus either. There's, I've recently found out there's some weird oddities on what is missing on there. Mm. Yeah. Like, they have all of the Toy Story shorts, but they don't have Buzz Lightyear or Star Command. Huh. I thought they did. So I know DuckTales is apparently very good, but it's also on its last season because Disney, for some reason, did fuck all to promote it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah and then when, when the, si uh, the service launched, DuckTales was put up out of order. Huh. <laughs> Which was weird. Yeah. Was Gravity Falls also a Disney adventure? Uh, yeah. Yeah, because I remember they they were weird about how they um, aired that, because they'd have like an episode and then you'd have to wait like eight months for another episode. And that's why I never finished Gravity Falls. Yeah, somebody who was keeping up with that. Like, as far as I understand, they did uh, go for the exact amount of time that they expected in terms of like episode count and seasons. Yeah. But. Yeah, like, that two-season show took, like, four years to fully come out. Yeah. <laughs> it did kind of show up at the perfect time still, though, because that was, like, peak me being into Slenderman and YouTube horrors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, after I, um, when I fell for Gravity Falls, I then watched Over the Garden Wall, like, you know, because I was jonesing for something like that, and that was a good pick, because Over the Garden Wall fucking rules. Ah! 
Also, God, this just reminds me that it took, like, three years for the first season of, uh, the new Marble Hornets sequel spiritual successor thing to happen. No, oh, boy. Oh, well, boy, we don't... <laughs> we don't want to get into that. <laughs> I mean, over to date... Well, I mean, this episode's already dated, but uh, at the time of recording, Disney's got its own thing going on, a controversy that, um... Isn't Disney's fault, really, for once? <laughs> Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. I just want to say, if you. I doubt any of our viewers have this fault, but if you think this whole Gina Carano situation is like, you know, James Gunn, uh, you are fucking delusional. She is not coming back. <laughs> she was shit talking Pedro Pascal, the, <laughs> the star of the goddamn show on Twitter. What the fuck do you think's gonna happen? Yes. <laughs> back off. Also, to date this episode further. Uh, yesterday, uh, as of time of recording, they just announced the entire Kingdom Hearts series is getting PC ports out of yeah, nowhere. Yeah, what the fuck? In like a month. And only on the Epic Store. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and also for too much money. So what you're saying is, we're getting another shot at Epic Mickey, in a sense. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> Fuck off! I'm going to download a booing sound effect and put it there just to piss you off even more. God, I wish I, wish I had my soundboard set up right now. <laughs> I would have some choice sound bites for you. Oh, I like this road. But I like the environment here. I like the road being a building that's twisting up into the air. That's really good. Yeah. Some really neat aesthetics at the end here. Yeah, they really know what they're doing with this area. Yeah, because at first I thought, oh, yeah, that's a road there. I was, oh, wait, you're, you're literally grinding up, like, neon uh, signs and stuff. Really cool. <laughs> it's our good Riku. friends, Riku and Girl. <laughs> Riku and the other one. <laughs> Sora's wife, and also Kairi. <laughs> <laughs> Sora. The edibles kicked in. <laughs> <laughs> I was wrong, Sora. The edibles were shit. Then. Then. Huh? Whoa. <laughs> uh, oh. No, don't turn me into Ven. Uh, uh, hang on, being Ven's okay. I accept this now. I don't care anymore. <laughs> <laughs> This was non canon because Terra didn't somehow shoot Sora in the leg. <laughs> what is going on? That's a good question. It's a very good question. Sora, you've got to wake up. Sora! You're entering the pudding dimension. <laughs> Oh no, Sora, you stood into the purple goo from Doom Eternal. You're at the worst part of the game, Sora. <laughs> oh, here come the floor tentacles. I saw that sign behind Sora, and I swear to God, Wait. I thought it said Los Ass for a second. I, I, for a minute, I thought it said Los Santos. I was like, no, I don't want Kingdom Hearts. You've got the Grand Theft Auto world. Kingdom Hearts is too good for that. <laughs> Oh no, Waka's going to show back up again. No, God, no. It's my headcanon that Aqua killed Waka and removed <laughs> him from the timeline at this point. <laughs> you could tell he was going to say a slur and broke his neck. <laughs> it was a mercy killing. <laughs> Hello, pretty lady. Have you seen any of them Albets? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he got Sora got evil dead camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh good, Master Chief's here to help. See Daisy. It wasn't easy putting you into a second sleep, and he almost woke up. Oh fuck up. off. What So then all that stuff I just saw. We're in an inception Did now, you put baby. That in my head? No. Get out of no. here, Christopher Nolan. That wasn't stuff. 
It was a dream. Coming to the realization that this guy might be the revolver Ross a lot of um, Kingdom Hearts. He just he has the guns and he's got that vibe. Ask your heart. What do you think Zigbar is like the true antagonist of the series? He's a, he's just a fucking liquid ocelot. Yeah. Thank you, Sora's heart, for pushing him. Oh, he's such a dickhead. Steer us wrong every time. You know, right? Because you all have hearts. Axel, and Roxas, and Namine, and that other girl. What's God face? damn it! <laughs> <laughs> and they laughed together, got mad, and they grieved. You have to have a heart to cry. <laughs> It's about time you noticed. Congratulations, sorry, you're no longer nobody racist. Is never lost for good. <laughs> well, no, he'll still indiscriminately murder the nobodies, it's just he understands them better now. <laughs> but a number of us it's a mercy killing. <laughs> showed signs of a burgeoning replacement. Once born, the heart can also be nurtured. Oh god, are we gonna get into nature versus nurture with you, Zemnis? Who <laughs> attempts to control the mind and convince it to renounce its sense of self. But understand, one can banish the heart from the body, but the body will try to replace it the first chance it gets for as many times as it takes. Is that fucked up and or so what? I knew. <laughs> After we were divided How fucked up would it be if there was one guy with a heart and one guy who didn't have a heart and one of them bashed the other on the head with a rock? Separation. Why then? Why did you lie to them and tell them they had no hearts? Xemnas and Xehanort formed the organization for a specific reason. Round up a bunch of empty husks. Hook them up to Kingdom Hearts, then fill them all with the exact same heart and mind. Translation? They were gonna turn all the members into Xehanorts. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Make more Xehanorts? You tricked your friends to... I hope you're ready for, like, you, the famous line from this video game. Turning into someone else? Me. I'm already half Xehanort. What? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> fuck you. There's, he fucking lifts up the eye patch and his other eyes the Sharon gun. But you're right, Sora. That is fucking nuts. For weakness of trust, most of the original members we had chosen... By the way, uh, the Kingdom Hearts channel in my Discord that I've locked you two out of uh, has been named Half Xehanort for two years after that line. <laughs> was to be expected. <laughs> Coming to the realization that him, like, the organization been half there or not, whatever the fuck, this is just turning into bleach. <laughs> <laughs> this last excursion has proven to be a worthy closing assignment for the organization. Just stop it! You treat people's hearts like bottles on a shelf, but they're not! Hearts are made of the people we meet, and how we feel about them. They're what ties us together even when we're apart. They're what make me strong. This lip sync is weirdly good. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> See, he did the he did the also lot hand gesture. You're pretty good. <laughs> like you. But no power. Sora's kicked the shit out of you like four times, mate. Yeah. Yeah, but those times he wasn't half Xehanort. Well, <laughs> I kind of feel fucking with me or not. <laughs> I'm definitely not, I swear. <laughs> if you look at, like, back at the other games, he has a different eye color in this mm. game. <laughs> because that's how you can tell people have been Xehanorted. <laughs> Friends, they are my power. Oh fuck! <laughs> oh hell yeah! 
It's time to show you the real superpower of teamwork. We are going to beat you to death. <laughs> Fine. See where your power gets you here. Xemnas, he's all yours. Why do you say that like you're commanding Xemnas? <laughs> Well, uh, time for us to fight this guy again. This time Good he's news, going to he does not turn into a boat this time. <laughs> There's the sigil. So your name shall be known as that of a recusant. That is just a Soul Calibur 6 fight intro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> he's just rampaging you with buildings in it. Throwing the city at you. On the stage of history, two hearts clash in light and darkness. <laughs> Round one. <laughs> yeah. Foolish. I'm trying to use a fucking cage in this game. <laughs> yeah. Jokes on you, Zemnis. Gay baby jail can't hold us. <laughs> He's embraced his gay babiness. He has gay baby pa call. <laughs> he became free from gay baby jail the second he freed his heart. Yeah. This guy does not seem as threatening as the last time we fought him. Uh, no, because counters are ridiculous, and you can kind of get him into a pattern. Yeah, I was about to say, you seem to be countering a lot better than in previous games. Is there just, like, a better window for it? Uh, I think so. And also, just, like, he's... His tells are a lot longer. Yeah, he has big wind-ups for his attacks. <laughs> But also, too, like, the other big difference is that we're playing on standard or proud, I think. Yeah. Yeah, these attacks seem much more problematic, because he just fucking covers the battlefield with buildings. These attacks are actually really easy to dodge. <laughs> Get him. Xemnas is no match for the gay rights keyblade. <laughs> also, real talk, this theme is really good. It is, it's it a is. really good track. Oh, I like that he gets stunned so you can wail on him. That's always good. Back off. What the hell was that? Oh, uh, the camera was a bit weird, but he fired a couple of laser bolts at us. Yeah, I wasn't sure if that happened or if your keyboard just spun off into 12 different keyboards after it hit him. Oh, that. Uh, that's like the strike raid upgrade or whatever that we have. Ah. Where you just threw the keyboard for a range attack and it turns into like a shotgun when it hits. Yeah, well, you would have kicked the shit out of Zemnus. Yeah. Hey, remember in Kingdom Hearts 1 when this guy kicked my ass? Yeah. And then in two, where he also kicked my ass, but that was because I was playing on critical. <laughs> God, I can't wait for those PC ports to inevitably make the critical modes post two like good. Oh boy, the recusant sigil. <laughs> He's gone. We'll never see him hey. again. Hey, so you want to know what uh, what the recusant sigil is? Well, mm -hmm. uh, you know the X that's in all the nobody's names. Oh, uh -huh. fuck off! That's not an X. That's the recusant sigil. Fuck off! <laughs> And the recusant sigil lets Xehanort know where you are at all times, which is also why Sora has an X on his shirt in this game. Uh. <laughs> There's fucking hell. 
I can't tell if that's clever or unbelievably fucking stupid. We told you. <laughs> it was not the sleeping keyholes that guided you. Kingdom Hearts is a series where the letter X means anything but the letter X. <laughs> yeah. It's the fucking severance symbol from the Slender Man series that doesn't need to be mentioned. on your chest is the proof. <laughs> what? See, that sigil, the X, it tells us where you are at all times. You had wondered aloud before why we kept showing up where you were. It's because we need you, Sora. This does not explain how they kept catching or up with Riku. To be <laughs> we need what will be left of you. The thirteenth dark vessel. What? What the fuck is this music? Why was it assured you would come Damn here weird. today? Because I followed my destined path, and I'm here looking at you right now. You can move through time. Theme of suspicious fart. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> the horn instrument sounds kind of farty, and you know it. <laughs> Yeah, it, the fart trumpets. We're meant to gather here. It's Kingdom Hearts penis and to music. You, Sora. <laughs> As our thirteenth member, these facts cannot be changed. What's gonna happen? I have now told you all that I know. We are all here. And what the future holds in store is beyond my sight. I will return to my own time and grow into the man who becomes all these others. While I know this future now that I have lived it, returning to my own time will erase the memories and experiences I have gained here. Oh, what? boy. <laughs> Oh, the time travel rules of Kingdom Hearts are convoluted. <laughs> Which will first lead me to seek the outside world. So he's basically trying to create a stable time loop to turn himself into Xehanort. In the folds of darkness, yeah. You Along with the ev 11 other Xehanorts, and then also now turning Sora so into Xehanort. To darkness. Good night. Sora. <laughs> Tiny oh. baby chair. <laughs> <laughs> he gets the opposite of a booster seat. <laughs> His seat is concave into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say, those chairs don't look comfy at all. No. Why, you don't want to sit on flat marble? Yeah. No back support? Huh. Every member of Organization 13 walks with a limp because of the fucking marble they sit on all day. <laughs> Listen, I got a fat ass, but my tail don't give out eventually, I'm not <laughs> <laughs> Is that why they just teleport everywhere? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody can fly and teleport because they can't walk anymore after sitting on those chairs. Is Sora <laughs> wearing a babby lingering will? No, that's Ventus' armor. Ah. I forgot. Oh yeah, lingering will's got this look, doesn't it? Yep. A glossary page explaining all the hearts tied to Sora's because there's no way you're going to remember that shit. Nope. We still got like an hour to go. Mm. Yep. <laughs> End of the road, huh? It's not yet. I well. know I'm back in the real world, but I still have my Dream Eater powers. Which means he still hasn't woken up. Where are you, Sora? That was a weird line read. <laughs> it is, yeah. Riku seems to get the weirdest line reads. I mean, he's been doing mostly fine. 
I mean, like from game to game, whenever we said that was a weird line read, it I, it feels like it tends to be from Riku. Yeah, probably. A dream eater. Is that where Sora is? A little bit. I love oh, this yeah, funny, gosh. cutesy music going on here. Yeah. <laughs> That's what happens if you mix a venom off. Gold bat and a jar of jelly beans. This kind of reminds me that there's a song in Smash Bros. called uh, Bath Time Vocal Mix. <laughs> Well, at least we don't have to go through the entire castle. I swear to God, I did not cut anything there. Oh, thank <laughs> God. That is a small mercy. Sora! Yeah? We already went through Riku's world. We don't need to do it again. <laughs> so much for going back to your own time, you conniving bitch. <laughs> Vessel? Yes. Fuck you, twin canal. <laughs> I was literally about to say, fucking Riku destroy the sassy twink. Darkness. So we did what the Keyblade did, and moved down the list. Uh, Roxas. Uh, now there was a worthy candidate. But, unfortunately, he became too aware of himself, and returned to Sora. Organization 13's true goal is to divide Xehanort's heart among 13 vessels. Thanks to you and Sora, we learned not all our candidates were fit for the task, but we managed to make up the difference. And now, Sora, the thirteenth vessel, is within our grasp. Thirteen? Xehanorts? It's almost as many Ansoms. <laughs> God damn it. I knew one of you was gonna make that joke. <laughs> what is... The real Organization 13. <laughs> the organization? I am Xehanort, from the most distant past. My future self gave me a task. To visit the splintered versions of myself in many worlds, and ensure they gathered here today. From the past? There are restrictions to movement through time. First, you must leave your body behind to do it. Okay. Then there must be a version of you waiting at the destination. Okay, this is tracking so far. Arrival, you can only move forward as per the laws of time. And you can't uh, relate the events that are destined to happen. What? <laughs> the most fucking point of doing it, you dipshit. My most future self will arrive soon. Then time for all of us will return to normal. What? Back to my era to live the life fate has in store. That's what you said last time. Vouch for that. Mm. Why would you? Why would him vouching for it mean anything? You're all lying sacks of shit. Oh, the world! Oh, the world! I'm glad I'm not too late. Mickey gets a stronger version of stop than you could get in the only game that has stop in it. I think. Okay. Nothing personnel. I said hands off. How can you be moving? You didn't pay me eight thousand dollars a month. <laughs> Therefore, I must, I mean, not stop. <laughs> yeah. Young Zay not drawing his sword and saying, By the way, I don't know how to work an oven. We told you that there was no wife in, in the organization, Riku. <laughs> Pay us 20 money. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Anyways, welcome to, uh, the hardest boss fight in this entire game. <laughs> yeah, god, he is, uh, flash-stepping all over. This man knows how to table hopper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh wow, he can just hit you from halfway across the map there. Boy, howdy, can he. That's not what makes this fight annoying, though. <laughs> Does it heal or some shit? <laughs> oh boy, I think I hit the nail on the head, didn't I? No. Also, yes. <laughs> what? He'll do some time travel bullshit or something. Okay, this is going okay so far. Uh. Um. is going on. Now we have to kill the clock. What? While young Xehanort continues to attack us. How much health does that clock have? The same amount as young Xehanort. Are you fucking shitting me? <laughs> but also there's uh like clones of him that are starting to show up too. What? Who planned who scripted this? What on earth? Also, it feels real weird having a boss fight in Kingdom Hearts that's like completely silent yeah. like this. <laughs> hmm. This is bad. Ah, uh, yeah. Thunder. I don't even know what to Lightning say. And this, the is, thunder. this is Demo May Cry to final boss of Dante's root bad. <laughs> well, penultimate boss. <laughs> I probably could have used Balloon more often than this, to be honest. You probably should have. <laughs> yeah. If, if ever was a, there was a fight to just cheat and spam Balloon, this is the one. Oh god, he's attacking me with X's. <laughs> Please, those are recusant sigils. Shut the hell up. No. No. <laughs> is that the end of it, or do you have to fight this prick one more time? No, that's the end. Oh. Congratulations, we have beaten the final boss. Oh, what a fucking boss. Yeah. Thanks, Mickey. I kind of wanted Riku to just turn around and say, I don't know what happened. Oh, there he is. Grandpa pisses back. We were right about you! <laughs> There's the bitch. All of this was decided. My twelve selves would welcome me here on this day, when I would return a complete person. You, uh, you're sounding a lot older there, Leonard. <laughs> <laughs> it's the future which lies He's even more raspy now. Why are you doing this? In ancient times, people believed that light was a uh, gift. This is the I've final time that Leonard Nimoy played of uh, Master Xehanort. <laughs> <laughs> I think he passed away like a year and a half after this game came out or something like that. Mm. Oh, fuck this. This shit again. <laughs> again, the letter X means anything but the letter X in this series. Some say Kai, but the meaning is the same. Into 20 pieces. Seven of light and 13 of darkness. And the only real Kingdom Hearts was swallowed by the darkness. Never to surface again. I once tried to create my own. You smug bastard. To forge the <clears throat> but the attempt ended in failure. You know, just in case you didn't play Birth by Sleep, despite the fact that we expected you to have played it, considering some of the shit from 20 minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> I can admit that now. God, that <laughs> shit-eating grin. What you did back then? See, the no worst sense. part about uh, Master Xehanort in this game is that he doesn't do any hand acting. Yeah. <laughs> or at least not to like the degree he did in Birth by Sleep. 
I merely guided them to their Destiny's office. never left to chance. The broken boy who <laughs> failed to be the blade. The misguided master who sacrificed herself for a friend. And the feckless youth who became my new vessel. Please, I think the term you're looking for is feckless neophyte. <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to believe that their sacrifice stopped you for good. Why? No one fucking dies, How Mickey. So you know that. How was I so blind? We've only That's defeated your heartless so and your nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Which, by all known laws of our universe, means that you would come back! <laughs> I used the evil fairy to find seven pure lights for me. <laughs> Describing Maleficent as the evil fairy. Jesus. It's lucky a microaggression, I think. But you feel a little homophobic. stopped you in your tracks on both counts. Yes, he did. That dull, ordinary boy. A Keyblade wielder so unlike any I have ever seen. However... They're not pointing at Sora and saying, mid. <laughs> Seven Guardians of Light and the Thirteen Seekers of Darkness. <laughs> There's that hand acting. Well, Seven well, but... Guardians of Light? Well... He's not making enough that you could make a video of like him making piano sounds every time he wiggles his fingers. Did I ever send you to that video from Birth by Sleep? I think you did, yeah. Okay. Because it's like the funniest video. <laughs> Just various shots of Xehanort and every time he wiggles his fingers and plays piano notes. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Including the one time where he just goes Keyblade and it just plays one note <laughs> All of the pieces are destined to appear What's with the heavenly glow on YouTube? <laughs> They're in a fucking gospel music video This is like a panel from a fucking shoujo manga The Keyblade <laughs> First, the thirteen darknesses shall be united. Do you think Master Xehanort's a fan of Creed? <laughs> yes. <laughs> also, I feel sorry for um, the joke I'm about to make, but Xehanort's drag race. <laughs> oh, no! Sora! There's that gif I've seen. <laughs> Mickey getting choke slammed. <laughs> In the corner you see Xemnas setting a table up. Oh. Deep Hawk at the table. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ooh. This is Kingdom Hearts 3D. <laughs> Kept you waiting, huh? <laughs> Axel, please. The name's Lee. Got it memorized. Got it memorized. Supposed to be here. Kept you waiting, I huh? Was I still like you, I'll Axel. But God, it's back. a shame you're voiced by who you're voiced what? by. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when I said he's our boy, I meant Axel. But you kind of forgot to write the sequel. <laughs> Now, let's find out what happens. <laughs> what now, you old coot? Isa. Let's get a backhand this real quick. <laughs> Why are you here, Axel? No, I told you my name's. <laughs> okay, that was a good guy. Now let's get out of here. Right. He spent so long telling everybody to get Axel memorized, and now everybody's just like, "Your name is Axel." <laughs> Damn it! I didn't expect they'd get it memorized. Ah, shit. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I can't believe Donald and Goofy beat the Guardian by just kind of landing on it. <laughs> Jesus. It's the first time Donald's ever been useful. <laughs> and it was on accident. We are out of time. And out of touch. <laughs> We must all return whence we came. And I'm out of my head when you're not a dork. <laughs> I'm just I'm out of my heart. <laughs> Let us finish this at the fated place. Once your lights and my darknesses have joined together. I appreciate that even though the script makes no goddamn sense at all, Leonard Nimoy was giving it his all. <laughs> <laughs> so he's literally, Xehanort was literally just like, alright, put your team together and then we'll have a big cool epic fight in Kingdom Hearts 3. Yeah, the 13 Seekers of Darkness and the self -ga Seven Guardians of Light are going to run at each other in an airport and the sure, shot will look right. terrible. <laughs> I was thinking more like Mortal Kombat or Armageddon. They they all clash in one big line, and Lee Mei is instantly killed. Ah, oh, ah, ah, Sora! Don't tell me your heart's sleeping too. No, Mickey. This affliction is not the same. Can we do anything for him? Yeah. In your Mark of Mastery exam, you were to unlock seven sleeping keyholes. By doing so, you would awaken those worlds from their prison of slumber, and also acquire the power to free a heart from its sleep. Does this mean that, like, Mickey, Donald, and Goofy you forgot about the events of Three Musketeers? Right? <laughs> and just kind of, like, remember, like, oh shit, right, that's how we met. <laughs> Before I kidnapped you from your world and made you into my knight and a mage. But, Master, Sora's heart is down in the darkest abyss. If Riku's not careful, he might just get trapped down there with him. No, I'll go instead. Why does Riku's, like, Kingdom Hearts 2 model look so weird in this game? There is no denying Riku stands the He seems taller and it's like his clothes don't fit. <clears throat> also his face, like his it, eyes. Yeah, he's a little too bishy. <laughs> Mickey. I really appreciate it, but I'll go wake Sora up. Riku! Look at his face, sleeping like nothing's wrong. Like there's what nothing an idiot. to worry about. He's always been like that. The three of us would agree to work on the raft, and then this guy would go take a nap on the beach. You see... It wasn't a nap, he was knocked out because Waka hit him in the head with a ball 50 times. What kind of keyblade master sleeps through his Please, we obtained three fish. I'm doing it for me too. And one egg. I thought you were going to say add one stench. I heard him call my name. He needs me. Hmm. There's something real strong that binds us to each other. Glue. Even in the darkness, you can reach him. All you gotta do is follow that connection. You just gotta believe. We're all connected to Sora. I like Axel just standing in the background. <laughs> and if the darkness gets you, I promise I'll bail you out. Dark Rescue's my middle name. What's your oh. last name? <laughs> Guys, Smith. thank you. <laughs> Sora and I will be back soon. That's too normal. <laughs> oh. Oh. 
<laughs> I love Donald getting all sad. He's just like, hell yeah. <laughs> this is actually good to me. <laughs> Riku preparing to shoot Sora in the heart with a rail gun. Light of darkness. <laughs> Gorge, light and darkness are the same thing, you idiot. You <laughs> fucking moron. <laughs> okay, the last dive, I assume. Tag 30 Soros. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, I, I like all the memories here. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is, this is pretty good, actually. Mm. Collect the Soros. Fellas, is it gear to collect 30 Soros? <laughs> <laughs> I like that you're kind of seeing a pattern in the Soros now. But no, I am liking all like the shared memories here. Yeah. I mean, uh, at this point, like it's kind of the ones that Riku is away from. You're just kind of seeing scattered shots of Sora's adventures, but. Mm-hmm. Also, I like that the diving music is. Uh, like a slower version of uh, Destati, the series theme. Mm. Mm. You've successfully collected 30 Soras. Now pick your favorite one. <laughs> the rest will uh, be killed. One of the ones that has the Kingdom Hearts 2 outfit, because that's the best outfit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's a lie. The 3D outfit is the best outfit. <laughs> What? I lied. This is the real final boss. <laughs> God, what is the armored Ventus nightmare? Isn't that a Starbucks drink? <laughs> I think I've had it before. Okay, I actually I, I like the environment changing from black to white. That's kind of neat. Yeah, it's neat. Uh, it's kind of a shame that this boss is incredibly like pitch black in an area that is pitch black with a skybox that is pitch black yeah they should have given this bo boss some like glowing lights i understand what they were going for yeah mm -hmm. and like you can still walk onto him so whatever yeah it's just aesthetically not too interesting Thunder! also you can't tell when to parry yeah kind of the only time it goes white like this, too, is when you're being attacked. Jeez, man, where did you learn to use so much darkness powers? You learned it from you, Terra. <laughs> I mean, more accurately, it was probably Vanitas. Yeah. Yeah! Heal! Leave me alone. <laughs> Just trying to live my damn life over here. <laughs> I do appreciate, though, that it's not actually that hard of a boss fight, because it's more of just like a thematic fight yeah. than anything. Yeah. So, the symbolism of the darkness and all the like weird goopy stuff just kind of makes it feel like you're fighting Venom with a sword. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, not, I'm sorry, but that Venom reminds me of Carnage, which reminds me I saw some of the fucking Spider-Man musical. Oh no. Oh jeez. It, it's wild to me that part of the reason that turned out so bad is that one of the writers made an OC. <laughs> also, oh shit, he did it, that's with a shot lock. <laughs> Holy shit, yeah, I just noticed that, yeah. <laughs> I like it when games have aesthetics, that, you know, um, attacks that they throw back out at you. Yeah, that was neat. Thank you. 
And he's dead. Alright, that was Ventus me. is dead. Xenus is in hell with terror. <laughs> <laughs> Specifically, it's hell because terror is there. Mmm, they're cracking that boy's helmet open like a Kinder Egg. Sora! The Kinder Surprise toy is a Sora. <laughs> it's illegal for me to comment on this joke in my country. <laughs> What about if you snuck a kinder's egg into an assault rifle? Would that be legal? Hmm. I'll find you, Sora. Only if you can shoot the eggs as ammunition. Hmm. God, I could go for a kinder surprise. <laughs> kinder chocolate's, like, really good. <laughs> they do have some regular kinder chocolate here, and that's really good. Hmm. And, like, the, the kinder buenos, like, the wafery things. Oh, like yeah, really buenos good. are good, yeah. It's been a while since I've had them, but, yeah. <laughs> So apparently I messed up because there's gonna be choices to make Boxes? here, and if you make the wrong ones, you don't get what is it that you're so the secret of? ending. Huh? Uh, <laughs> and I couldn't be asked to try and download the secret ending because nobody has it uploaded by itself in decent quality. <laughs> oh no. But here, I'm just gonna tell you what happens because it's like 20 seconds long and it's just going... Aqua is teaching Kairi how to use a keyblade. Oh. <laughs> Which isn't even true. Or not Aqua. Um, like, Yed Sid Wait, decides to take Kairi on as an apprentice or something. Damn, that's less interesting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and less appealing to my fanfics. <laughs> I forgot, because Aqua's still dead in <laughs> hell. Uh, Aqua leaning down to Kairi and saying, Aren't friend. you trying to be nice? <laughs> What is going on? I guess this is as good as mine, buddy. Sora! <laughs> okay, that's the least looking like Sora person so far, Riku. Yeah, he looks like he has evil anime villain hair. Huh? It's the Mishion, isn't it? Oh, oh, it's actually mm -hmm. my child, my sweet, adorable daughter. <laughs> Riku, what do you wish? More questions. All right. Just gonna watch the sunset with this mysterious girl no one knows. <laughs> I wish. I wish that Austin would acknowledge you. <laughs> and protect my friends. I am acknowledging her. It's not my fault that I don't know who she is. <laughs> I'll fucking... I'm gonna come to Canada and I'm gonna unlock your memories. <laughs> With these hands. I was gonna say, that's a weird way to phrase threatening to punch somebody. <laughs> <laughs> I put all my Nerf guns away, but if I hadn't, I would grab one and make the fucking gun cocking noise. <laughs> <laughs> You were not the visitor I expected. Diz! I mean, Ansem the Wise. Return of Darkness in Zero. <laughs> Is this guy naughted yet? His eyes are gold. No, that's just how his, his eyes have always been. I have brought. I felt that I ought to leave at least something behind. Quick reminder, so this I is not Christopher Lee. <laughs> no, yeah. And hid them within Sora. So this is... Data? Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> what? Wait, huh? A clue, I hope, to finding yourselves or your lost friends in your hour of need. There better not be any fucking bugs in this. 
The heart has always been quick to grow. Each exposure to light, to the natural world, to other people, shapes this most malleable part inside of us. Every time I get exposure to light, I just get sunburned. <laughs> Nobody's are not different from us in that manner. Sora was the only one able to return to his human form without destroying his nobody. That is a statement to the love in his heart for other people and the bonds that tie them together. Perhaps he has the power to bring back the hearts and existences of those connected to him. To recreate people we thought were lost to us forever. Like Roxas, <laughs> Ventus, Even and that black-haired girl who keeps showing up that you keep getting mad at me about. And the petals. Austin, shut up, bitch. I'm getting ready. I'm fucking. And it gearing up. Take superhuman powers to see them. Surely we remember, as children, the way our hearts made everything seem so shiny and perfect. Sora has a heart like that, uncorrupted, willing to see the good before... The Sora is like, imagine four hearts hanging on the edge of a cliff forever. <laughs> when a connection seems broken... That was the real final boss of this game, that was the fucking young Xehanort's Zyborn clock. <laughs> he has accepted them, and he has saved them, and some of those hearts have never left him, whether they fell into darkness or were trapped there, whether they sleep in the darkness of Sora's heart, or were welcomed into its warmth. They can be saved. I do like that Sora's happy place is just back home. Mm. Yeah. It is that his heart takes him. Also, where is the city in the Destiny Islands? It should be in this direction, I think. <laughs> the rest is in there. All right. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> Muchos gracias. Uh... Uh, I kind of need to wake Sora up. Don't tell me he's gone to sleep again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What'll I do with him? What, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Never fear. Sora is safe. Huh? He's not here. You see, by defeating the nightmare imprisoning Sora, you freed him. Uh, you mean the Sora wrapped in that black phantom? Then you came here, and you were questioned by three young people. That was the final key to awaken him. Sora is awake. Sora's woke now. <laughs> you can go home now. That's just been true since the beginning. Thank you. Oh no, he wasn't nice to the nobodies. <laughs> Young man. I do not believe you ever told me your name. It's Ansem. <sighs> it's Riku. <laughs> I mean, technically he wouldn't have been wrong to have told him that he was Ansem, because he was Ansem in 2. Yeah. I genuinely for a second expected him to say it's Ansem. <laughs> It's Judgment Kazzy. <laughs> <laughs> Sora! Huh? Hey, Donald! <laughs> Come on, you're hogging it all! Ah, oh, calm down, Sora! I'm good, good, good. 
Hey, yo, what? T says? Hey! <laughs> it's paint, asshole! <laughs> Free <Riku. laughs> uh, Wait, in a party hat is a powerful hey, image. Why are you having a tea party? You're safe, Riku! <laughs> You okay? Feeling all right? Yeah. I've never been better. I was watching what was going on in my dream. And I could hear your voice the whole time. Thanks, Riku. Thanks, everybody. Fucking Axel. I wish he kept on, like, the uh, March on Grau or Marx <laughs> classes. Oh, yeah! Did we pass the test? Hmm. You performed truly admirably, both of you. <laughs> Alright, that was a neat call. <clears throat> yeah. More than anything. I am grateful to have you both back from Xehanort's deception unharmed. And I am grateful to Lee, whose spontaneous actions turn the tides. I am also deeply sorry for failing to perceive the danger. And yeah, you're kind of a giant fuck up, Yen said. Remember when the mar mark of mastery test was just, hey, fight a couple of balls? <laughs> <laughs> Terra still couldn't do it. Gird ourselves for the great <laughs> clash with darkness that lies. Oh, I don't like Yen Sid saying that word. I believe we need a new Keyblade Master. One with a new kind of power. Sora and Riku, you both deserve the honor. However, one of you braved the realm of sleep again to unlock the final keyhole and save a friend. Riku, I name you our new true Keyblade Master. Oh, damn. <laughs> Way to go, Riku! <laughs> yeah? I knew you were gonna pass with flying colors. This is just so awesome. Gee, Sora, you're kinda acting like it's you that passed. I told you so, I still need some practice. Hey. Oh, fuck you, Donald. Really? I'm a Keyblade Master? Congratulations, Riku! Uh. Thank you, Mickey. I really like that I owe it. Sora oh, finds out it's not him and just immediately uh, starts going like, Shit! No yeah, that rules! <laughs> You want to be a Keyblade Master? Yeah. I mean, I came here to learn how to wield one. You? you? <laughs> hey, thanks for the vote of confidence. You know I was going to come swooping in, Keyblade in hand. But I just couldn't get mine to materialize. Must be in the snap of the wrist or something. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. So, uh, despite the fact that the opening movie, which I didn't show because spoilers, uh, <laughs> plays uh, simple and clean, uh, the ending of this game plays Sanctuary, so thanks again to Dusk! Yeah. Hey, shout out to Dusk! Thank you to Dusk for saving us from a uh, Utada Hikaru breaking our necks once we're going. Very careful. <laughs> right. See you soon. It needs to be me that breaks Austin's neck <laughs> for disgracing my daughter. <laughs> There's a Kingdom Heart. We did it. We defeated Kingdom Hearts during drop distance. There's still 15 minutes left. Kingdom Hearts uh, Tiger drop distance. <laughs> God, I mentioned it in my Discord like the other night, but 
the worst part of Yakuza 5 is that Haruka doesn't fight, so I don't even get the satisfaction of watching her beat up the rival idols that have been yeah. giving her shit the entire part. <laughs> <sighs> Hashtag give Haruka a gun. <laughs> I saw someone take a photo of, like, Haruka looking angry after Kiryu slaps her in Yakuza Kiwami and, like, she does look like she's about to throw down with him. <laughs> <laughs> There was someone who modded, um, I think someone actually modded Yakuza 5 so they could use Haruka, <laughs> Haruka's model. Because it works with the heat actions. Oh right. yeah, I think I've seen that. <laughs> Haruka just picks a dude up and throws him off the Sotenberg bridge. <laughs> <laughs> someone gave a fucking Saijima's like, move set, so it's more like uh, Haruka lifts someone over her head and then slips spikes him into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> What's left of me? So many ups and downs. My heart's a battleground. So, uh, boy, have is 3D. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go on record yet again and say that this is by far easily the game I'm like the worst game of the series that I am willing to put up with playing through. <laughs> Whatever even happened with the, the fucking world ends with you, children? Oh, uh, we sent them back home. All right. Because they were stuck in Sleep Traverse Town, so we woke them up. Um, <laughs> I'm. Half expecting there to be some kind of Kingdom Hearts references in uh, the new World Ends with You thing. Because of the whole, like, hey, we'll meet again some other time with, like, Neku and Sora. Yeah, the fucking Nomura cinematic universe. <laughs> <laughs> Here's hoping uh, Disney do a partnership with Sega so then we can get uh, Yakuza like a Dragon Kingdom Hearts crossover. <laughs> <laughs> Give Ichiban a baseball bat keyblade. Turns out Ichiban is just, is just fucking Lee's weird estranged cousin. <laughs> God, I hadn't actually listened to this cover in a while. This cover still rules. Yeah, this cover fucking slaps. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I think the writing in this game, it's not good per se, but it's fun in, like, the Kingdom Hearts fashion that he would want it to be. <laughs> I just wish this game didn't suck so much ass <laughs> to play. <laughs> <laughs> I love that they have to, like, credit the characters. <laughs> Not the actors, <laughs> the characters. God. Ah, the grid was such characters as Kevin. <laughs> Just thinking about all the horrible things we said in the Tron world. <laughs> <laughs> I maintain my opinion that Takora looks like a love doll. No! <laughs> You're not wrong. It's very dead-eyed stare, and I hate it. You're not wrong, but also, no, Austin. <laughs> I love that they credit Jesse McCartney twice in a row. Yeah. Yeah. And also hated Penetera as somebody. Yeah, I understand I'm the last person who should say no, but, you know. <laughs> I think this is the last game that Hayden Penetera voices uh, Kyrie and what's her face. Because mm -hmm. uh, at this point, or after this, she was like busy doing Until Dawn and other sh shit. Mm -hmm. 
Mm. So uh, she is instead, or those characters are instead voiced by Allison Stoner from Huron, I mm. think. Mm. Who I mostly remember was in some, like, Disney Channel shit. Oh, wow, it's near Automata. <laughs> She's in a, what is it, she's in a Phineas and Ferb, I think. Yeah, she is. Shit like that. She, she was, yeah, I think. Did she play the sister or something? No, no that was she, was, um, she was one of the other kids, I think. I, I've, never, I've like almost never watched Phineas and Ferb, I just know she's in it. By the way, if y'all could figure out uh, what this message is supposed to be saying before it becomes incredibly obvious. Oh god, it's Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> Get crunk. <laughs> so monkey. Beginning with M is Mark. Or Marks. Secure Mark. <laughs> Second word, memories. No, can't be. Certain... Oh, uh, something unlocked. So... Sucra mod. Sa sa sacred message unlocked? Secret, secret message, message unlocked. Secret yeah, it's secret message unlocked. Uh, <laughs> it just unlocks like a thing you look at in the glossary, so I'm just gonna read this out to you, uh, because I looked it up in the meantime. <laughs> it just says, The past will be reawakened as a new number in never-before-seen detail. Prepare yourself for the awakening of the next number. <laughs> Did that just mean Kingdom Hearts 3? Yeah, the, like, they were basically just going, Hey, this straight up is Kingdom Hearts, or like the last one before 3. And then it wasn't! And then it fucking wasn't. We've still got a movie and a tech demo to get through. <laughs> is that really all we got left? Down. Yeah, it's uh, huh. just 0 0.2 back cover and then we're on to 3. We're coming up on it, folks. Yeah, we are closing in. It's been almost like two and a half years, but we're getting there. <laughs> All these broken YouTubers left by Kingdom Hearts <laughs> and then there's us. <laughs> Why is Mickey... Mickey... Yeah, this... I would say Mickey looks like he's generating fucking Microsoft clip art messages. <laughs> For the record, by the way, this is the, uh, this is like a take on the Dream Eater, like, hangout music that never actually played in this Let's Play, because I didn't want to go through the nonsense of the menus. This one. This one. <laughs> one. That was an L. Take this L. <laughs> no. I've never taken an L in my life. This Lee. What's the message about Lee? This Lee D? This Lee I don't want to know about Lee's D. Next word will be S. This Lee, yeah. this Lee dies. Why is Frollo here? <laughs> <laughs> Phoebus, you have a big sword. Kill him with your big sword. <laughs> Damn, this Romani, Romani magic. This leads to... To... 
Bye. Is that just two with like a country accent? <laughs> this leads to something. <laughs> Exactly four QA testers. Oh look, Geppetto! Yeah, Geppetto got reunited with his wretched, despicable child. <laughs> Speaking of despicable, absolutely disgusting. <laughs> This leads to Kevin. Kevin. <laughs> Who is Kevin? <laughs> oh, this is going to mean this leads to Kingdom Hearts, isn't it? Yep. Got it in one. It's not too late. It might be saying King King Harkinian. <laughs> this leads to King Vendrick. <laughs> this leads to King Dragon. Oh, I love it. <laughs> oh, Mr. Mew. <laughs> Where's Nemi? Show me Nemi. That's a hell of a strut you got going on there, Pete. <laughs> got the Chad Shrut going. Undeservedly. <laughs> I, e. I think if any Pete was a Chad, it'd probably be the one from Steamboat Willie. <laughs> if he got his spine broke and he still got up and fought. <laughs> I Satan. Satan's here to tell, teach you about the letter A. A is for us, Faudel. R stands for real gun. Do you know what letter ends in T? That's right, kids. Submit. <laughs> Also, there's, like, uh, one of the credits there said Marvel licensing, and I have no idea why, because there is no Marvel shit in this. Mm. Isn't, isn't it till the next one was technically some Marvel stuff? Because I'm not sure if Big Hero 6 was a Marvel property. It is, but that's not in this game. Yeah, so. Hmm. When did Disney get the Marvel license? Because maybe it just got grouped in with that. Around the time Avengers came out, I think. Mm. Also, mm. look at that. They're splitting it into a three. This leads to Kingdom Hearts 3. Yes. Except it kind of doesn't. It <laughs> fucking doesn't. Anyway, Kingdom Hearts uh, 3D Revengeance is done. <laughs> <laughs> Cryptic message. Yeah, that's the... A new number will be found in never-before-seen detail or whatever. Never-before-seen detail. Sora is in Sleepy Town again. Good. I was hoping this world was still here. Jesus, why? <laughs> but where are they? Sora will return in Avengers Endgame. Xehanort. Yeah. <laughs> Xehanort will return. <laughs> I still thought that was pretty clever at, like, the post-credits of Infinity War to go Thanos will return. <laughs> yeah. They were right. Hmm. Briefly. <laughs> well, he came back again later. There. The movie's long, a lot of shit happened. Oh, I love it! <laughs> Where's Nemi? Uh -huh. Not mascot, uh, not mascotable enough. 
She's mascot of my heart. Give me my Nemi. Hey! Well, you can have the fruit gosha gold back. Oh, there's one. There she yeah, is. There you go. There's still Yogi here to give all of our loyal uh, viewers the epileptic fit. I'm amazed they didn't just kill these things off off screen and forget about them. <laughs> <laughs> no. no, we can't go back. We cannot go back. No, we can't go back. You can never go this back. This is a dark place full of dark people. Well, oh. thanks for watching. See y'all next time. <laughs> How can anyone Bye. be happy in Castle Oblivion? See you. God damn it. <laughs> See you next time.